Hey all, and welcome to the Iron Empire. This is just a short um, video update uh, on what I'm doing today. Um, I'm just in the Doom Sled, and I've got a day of running some errands. So I'm taking or making the most of the opportunity of uh, not having any jobs today, and I'm just uh, doing a few bits and pieces. And while I'm out and about, I'm gonna be delivering some business cards of mine, which uh, if you don't already know is uh, Adelaide White Wall Tires, this is my business. And um, yeah, basically just spreading the word of uh, hitting up all my local businesses in the area. Um, we are currently in the middle of a worldwide uh, virus scare. Uh, it's a pretty serious thing obviously happening, everyone's affected. And um, a lot of people are afraid to spend money. Everyone's basically uh, going to hiding. So uh, I think it's pretty important that like collectively as a community, like especially, you know, in Australia, we got to support the local businesses because a lot of these places are going to go belly up with no income. So I'm going to, it's only a little bit of contribution, but today I've got to do a few things for the Dodge. I've got to go get a new battery and I've got to obviously fill up with fuel uh, and do a few other little bits and pieces. So I'm doing that today. And yeah, this is my way of just spreading the word. All right, I'm on my run this morning, just doing a few car drops, and I thought I'd swing past the OG Speed Shop. Uh, it's been here forever. Um, obviously, they do a lot of speed parts. I just dropped in to get a bit of fuel and drop off some business cards, have a chat with the boys, and basically let everyone know that I'm, anyone that I speak to today, I'm letting them know that I'm still trying to support local businesses and uh, just trying to get out and not panic about this thing. So um, if everyone does the same, just keep, the, uh, keep everything going, we'll be fine. Another stop for today is uh, Active Batteries. They're down here at Wingfield. They specialise in wire recycling and also automotive batteries and industrial batteries. Uh, I've got a glass mount battery in this um, Dodge, like a deep cycle one, uh, which is for the air ride system. So we're going to hit up the, uh, Active Batteries and get a new one. It's been in the car for like six years, so we'll go see the boys and see what they can do for me. She warming up now. Um, got the fresh uh, AGM in there now and problem solved straight away. As soon as I turn the air ride on this car on, it will usually cut out after literally like five seconds because the air ride ECU has an override in it. When it drops below 10.5 volts, automatically cuts out to save the computer. I've just put this new uh, battery in and instantly it ran until the tank reached capacity so I'm stoked. So now I'll drop off some cars to the boys so they can spread the word for my business. Uh, once again they're active batteries, um, done me a really good deal on this AGM, they're like usually really really pricey batteries. Um, yeah if you're in the Adelaide area come down and see the boys and uh, they'll sort you out. Well I finished all my errands for today and um, yeah I hit up probably, I you don't know, a good dozen or more businesses, um, spread the word for myself, and uh, met a few good people, which was always good. Um, I've just got home, and the battery that I put in the car from Active Batteries has been awesome. The um, compressors have run until the tanks reach capacity every time. The only thing that's holding me back now is that I've got it wired up through only one compressor because I was trying to overcome the um, load sort of overdraw problem. So now that I'm home, I've got a, another relay and I'm gonna connect up my second compressor um, and then see how the new battery handles that. So the air ride setup in the back of this Dodge is, it actually was a very neat setup at the moment I've got all my tools and everything in here and it's dusty as anything so please don't judge me too harshly um there's one compressor here's my tank there's all the copper lines they used to be very nice uh and here is the um wiring setup and up here i've got a second allocation for another relay so once i add this bad boy oh bam she in that technically should um, be sending power through to both compressors now. So when I turn on 
the system. I should have pull, full power going to two comps. Got nothing. I think the tank's already full. Here we go. Still done. I'm stoked. That's two comps running. That's twice as quick to pump up this tank. So um, it's been years since it's run that well. So the new battery's done the trick. Thanks to the lads at Active Batteries. Um, so yeah, pretty much to recap, I didn't have a lot of things I needed to do today, but just my little contribution um, to the locals um, is all that anyone needs to do. So get out there, spend your money, whether it's buying takeaway food or buddy getting your car serviced or bits and pieces. Um, stay calm and support the locals. Cheers guys, see you next time.